Set another delay here. This one will use more experimental approaches. Automation for look like feedbacks. So I'm going to click the slow wiggly line here and it reveals our automation tracks manipulated. Here, and as I raise up the mouse, you can see the curves shape accordingly as well. Some very interesting patterns. Let's see, right here we had the read write so we can write anything. All the congas are running, so go from the top, right where the congas get in there. I'm going to start writing the high pass filter. So in conclusion, this is how we make music inside X2, it's just one of the many ways. And my particular tune, with a little bit of more mixing and mastering, I'm pretty much ready to take this to the stage or any other application it has for in the market. So I hope you got to enjoy and kind of learn a few of the features we can do here. I personally love to thank uh, Dean Capper, Dan Gonzalez, Ryan Munnis, part of the Cakewalk staff, and the entire Cakewalk team for just having me and allowing me to express myself with this technology. It is quite a pleasure to always discover new things and interact with it. So I hope you enjoy and this has been Wig Bricaro aka Modul Octopus. Check me out on SoundCloud, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, the whole shebang. I'm always giving gifts to people every week and expecting the best of myself. So I hope you guys enjoy. Peace.